Do you know the details of your life insurance policy? If not, Andrea Brown from Crouppen, or Andrea McNary, excuse me, with Brown and Crouppen says that you should. Fox 2's Vic Faust discusses that in tonight's Legal Lens. Do you really know what's in your life insurance policy? Life insurance policies are at their basic form just contracts. So you need to look in the fine print for what you're actually purchasing and to see what is actually included in that policy. When you talk about the fine print, what should you be looking for to make sure you're actually getting what you pay for? What insurance companies do is they set up exclusions within the policy. That's what the fine print is, what it covers and what it doesn't. Common exclusions we see that you should be aware of are material misrepresentations, meaning you weren't honest in your application such that if there is a claim made later, they can go back and say you didn't disclose the most common example of smoking. Other exclusions we see are illegal activity, alcohol and drug use, dangerous activities such as skydiving. And the final thing I would say is look at, it's not really an exclusion, but a policy inclusion, which is the contestability period of time. So usually it's by state, but a period of time after a claim is made which a insurance company can go back and look for a reason to deny the claim. Is there fine print that people seem to overlook from experience that you've had with this subject? I would say most often it's the material misrepresentation or the contestability period. For instance, you can die from a sickness, but if you did not disclose that you had high blood pressure during that contestability period, an insurance company can go back, even if the blood pressure condition wasn't related to your cause of death, can say you didn't disclose this, and so now we're not going to pay. How often are insurance companies actually going back and contesting? It's a pretty common occurrence. I mean, insurance companies are designed to make profits, and, and they do that by minimizing their risk and minimizing on what they will pay on. So obviously if a claim can be denied or a claim cannot be paid out because they can find something within that contestability period, something that somebody wasn't honest about or didn't disclose that will keep them from paying a claim, they will. Andrea McNary with Brown and Crouppen reminds everyone to read and know your policy. And on next week's Legal Lens, we talk specifically about life insurance policies being affected by deaths caused by COVID-19.